Hello once again, and we're going to have a game of the Young Ones for the Amstrad CPC. Um, I have never played this game before, um, so I just I, was, I just want to play this game because I was a big fan of the Young Ones. I um, still am. I, I, I still like watching the television series. Uh, I watched it first time I ever watched it when it first aired back in 1982 when I was only eight years old, and watching that was absolutely brilliant um, if you ain't ever watched it already and if you're too young to remember the young ones I suggest you check it out now because they didn't they don't know how to make comedy these days and you cannot be 80s or 90s comedy um, uh, they're just the best just the best because you could get away with whatever you wanted back then even the 70s comedies I have to say were pretty good um, and I was a bit young back then, but I always saw the reruns of him. Anyway, let's get on with the game, shall we? So we got the four main characters, which is Vivian, Neil, Mike and Rick. Um, Vivian's obviously the, the punk. Um, Viv uh, Neil is the hippie. Mike, the cool person. And Rick, the anarchist. <laughs> all playing great um, characters. You know, they're all good characters. All worked off each other. That's why the comedy series worked. Sadly, it only lasted two series. Only 12 episodes were ever made of it. Um, but it's a pity. I mean, it's always a good to watch again and again. Brilliant. You never get bored of it. It was one of my favourite comedy series. Um, right, so enough waffle. Let's get on with the game, shall we? So we'll put it on keyboard. Motherfucking it responding. Right. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong bloody button, that's why. And we're going to choose Vivian, so let's start the game. Yeah. Okay. I, I've seen a sort of review on this on YouTube, but I wanted to play it for myself. Um, but how the fuck do you move the... Oh, don't tell me it's all fucking done by... Um, uh, commands. So you can't actually physically control the character. It's all done by commands by the looks of it um, so action why is it fucking not working oh, I've got to push space bar right let's get the radio pick up right so we've got the radio so let's walk let's walk to the garden I mean the graphics are well and truly shit Yes, they've done it in mode one, but this looks like a fucking spectrum port once again for the Amstrad CPC, which is always an unpleasant experience because the Amstrad was capable of so much more than crappy spectrum ports, as we all know. Um, so, all the characters are yellow. Um, couldn't even give it, I mean, they could have done it in mode zero and given it more colour. I mean, the graphics are crap anyway, so it wouldn't matter if it was a little bit blockier. Um, at least we would have had nice colour. Um, so let's go to action. Uh, flower pot. Do we have to pick it up? Can't we smash it up? I'll pick it up, so action. Right, let's have a look at the flower pot. Smash. So at least we get sound effects, but the sound effects are pretty shit. Um, walk. Let's go to the hall. Oh, I don't know what's going on here. I think the idea of the game is is to leave your house off. Oh, I don't know if you got a, if you're getting evicted from your house or what. Um, and you got to collect all your belongings and get out. Basically, that that's what I think the premise of the game is. But, but I honestly. Would you even want to bother yourself playing this fucking game? Look at the state of it. It's just crap. It's just a rubbish game. It really is rubbish. Let's go to Narnia because I'm not, that's where he goes into the wardrobe and disappears. And meets that woman that offers him some Turkish delights. A certain person called Mike has picked up. All right. There's Rick. Let's talk to Rick. Can we talk to Rick? No. Oh, he's fucked off. Why can't we talk? Oh, we did. Right, talk. There's Neil there. Suddenly I have my... Oh, I don't fucking... 
This is just crap. Let's go to the cellar. It looks like Neil's coming and all. Right, so action. Gas and a five pound note. Oh, interesting. So we've got Neil here. Oh. Pick it up then. Oh. Right. Walk below stairs. Oh, I don't fucking know. Oh. Action. Super glue lager. Well, action. Let's drink the lager, I suppose. Put down. Well, you can't do nothing with the lager. Action. Gas cylinder, oil. Super glue. Let's pick up the super glue. Right, action. Ah, oh, this is just shit. Too bad, perhaps we can make a cup of tea. Walk. Oh, this goes in the hall. Yeah, the sound effects are just utter shit. Everything about this game looks shit, plays like shit. Ah, oh, you know, a good comedy series could have done with a good game, I'd say. But no, they just offers this fucking awful crap. It is crap. Every, I, I, just all you're doing is just doing commands. They could have made a better game than this. Um, laundrette. Ah, oh, this, I ain't gonna play this too much longer. This, this is just, this is just rubbish. What's a rubbish? And how do we get, right, so we've walked out the house to the laundrette. Oh, I think I know why, because you've got to remember in the TV series, they jumped in the air. Boing, boing, there was at the, at the laundrette, weren't they? <laughs> um, action. Fire for radio Soap machine, open. Action. Oh, fuck it now. Pick up. This is boring. I am not fucking interested in this game because I'm so bored. I can't, I can't play this no more. I'm, I'm just utterly bored um, doing all this shit all over again. Um, it's absolute shit. In other, uh, 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 it's just bad. It was, it, it's just absolutely fucking shit. This game. I was expecting much better. Okay, I knew the graphics were shit, but I didn't realise all you have to do is fucking do your commands. I thought you had to actually play the character and go around like um, um, the other game I just reviewed, um, How to Be a Complete Bastard. I thought it'd be on them sort of lines, but it's nothing like that. I ain't gonna play this game no more. I just can't be fucking bothered with it. It, it, it. Just look at it. It's shit. Everything's about it. Everything about this game is just utter fucking shit. Um, should never have been fucking released. Um, I'm quite curious to see what the Commodore 64 version is like because I originally had um, out to be a complete bastard on the Commodore 64. Um, but I honestly, thought um, I don't know. It wasn't a lot of difference from the Amstrad version, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, so I might see what it's like on the Commodore 64. Fucking be bothered. If it's anything like this, then fuck it. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, and goodbye.